Now step two in our 18 steps is called file properties. We do need to set up some properties regarding this file which will be used by the headers and footers primarily in the reports. Also you'll find that as we work with project you'll see that the title will be used eventually as a project summary task. So despite all that your second step is to go to file and from here go to project information. You can already see some information showing. We've set the start date a week from today which is the 5th of June for us and it's also said well that's the finish date. We're scheduling from a start date and we're using a standard calendar. I'm going to click project information and go into advanced properties. Now when you go into advanced properties you can set up things like a title, a subject and so on. So the title is this is a maintenance contract. And it's actually the subject is a residential, so it's a residential maintenance contract. The author, I would like you to put your name, but I'm going to leave my name there. And the manager, I'd like you to put my name. So put your own name as the author. The company is simply called Mad About Maintenance Limited. Now you could put in a category and some keywords and some comments. You could also save a preview picture. Um, but that's as far as I want to go for now, so I'm just going to click OK. And that's that done. And we'll see the effect of that when we come to Reports and also when we come to the Project Summary task. For now, I'd like to press Escape or click the Back button and get out of the Properties. And that's Step 2 done.